Waking up at Crooked Fiber Farms was so cozy and I was especially excited when I opened up the blinds and found freshly fallen snow. It was the perfect quintessential winter on the farm feeling or vibe as you might say. Then I headed downstairs, I made a little bit of coffee, and then I actually made myself a Pop-Tart for breakfast. I want to see that comment section filled with those of you who have a favorite Pop-Tarts flavor. Mine? I actually don't know what mine is, but it's certainly not the one that I made this morning. This morning I made uh, whatever my dad had, it was some kind of a double chocolate, and it went really well with the coffee, but I was kind of wishing it was a warm brown sugar one. Listen to her. She's singing praises. We're having wontons. Why They're is it so red? Because that's a recording. It'll let you know. Okay. The we official finished. drink of the legacy. Of the legacy. Sorry for all that are judging right now. Don't. Don't judge. No judging. The first two rounds of orders. We did it. We did it. They're not out yet. They're just all died. Mm -hmm. They're coming. Mm. We need nourishment. We're starving to death. Mm -hmm. 
Oh. These are so good. So these are chicken wontons. From Costco. From Costco. With chili. Chili Thai sauce and soy sauce mixed together. Are they cooked all the way through? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we just finished recording a podcast. We did it. It's going to go up on YouTube. Mom is catching up with her phone. It was a great podcast, though. It was really fun. It felt it short and sweet. Short and sweet. Although it was 45 minutes, but that doesn't include all of the interruptions from they the kids. lots of interruptions. <laughs> they were really interested in being on camera. So. Yes, they were. But they were very sweet. They weren't obnoxious. No. Winnie did some barking. It felt like it was not nearly as bad as last time, though. No. Because I feel like Dad was up here last time, which is why she was barking so much. It was us and it was Dad. <sighs> I am drinking out of Mrs. Claus. I don't know if I showed this this morning. But I'm having iced coffee, even though I warmed it up. It gets lukewarm so quickly. So now the girls and I are going to get bundled up. I'm going to warm up the car. We're going to head back to Essex. I feel like I might curl up in one of these chairs. You should. Throw on some vlog. What is that? Okay, I just got out of the grocery store. I have not been to the grocery store by myself without kids in tow. Literally, I couldn't even tell you the last time. So I took my time, I perused the aisles, got myself a snack. Yes, that says party size. No, don't judge me. I love popcorners. Um, so I'm heading home now because I have so much editing to do after the last couple of days at Crooked Fiber Farm, spending it with mom. But I just need a few minutes to breathe. So I'm gonna sit here, I'm gonna eat my chips, I'm gonna listen to my podcast. I'm right now, I'm listening to Armchair Expert with Dax Jeopard, the John Baptiste uh, interview, which so far, like I'm only six minutes in and I'm already in love with him, <laughs> first off. Second off, I know there's an amazing documentary on Netflix right now that's all about him his journey, his journey in conjunction with his wife's battle with cancer, it's supposed to be absolutely groundbreaking, profound, beautiful. And I really want to watch it. And now that I've started listening to the interview, I'm like, I, I have to watch it soon. I think it's kind of like a heavy, more emotional watch. So I want to be like in the right mindset to watch it, if you know what I mean. But anyways, I'm going to sit here. I'm going to do this for like three minutes and then I got to get home because I got food for the girls for dinner. I got them chicken nuggets. Typically they're like the dino shapes, but today I got them alphabet shapes, which I think is going to be even more fun. So psyched to see their reaction. Now I'm going to relax.